Welcome back, welcome back, welcome back to my channel. So today for you all, I have a Victoria's Secret haul. Things that range from um, a sports attire, which is my favorite attire to wear, as well as some uh, sleeping garments, as well as undergarments. So um, if you all are interested in uh, those types of things, please continue to watch and also just so you all know, this video may be long. So if you are not into long videos or hauls, you might want to click out. I don't know how long it's going to be, but it may be long. But before we jump into this video, you all already know the deal. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel, as well as hit that notification bell. That way you all can be informed as to when it is that I do post videos. Most of the time, it's every other day, but you never know. So, uh, yeah, let's just jump into this video because like I said, it will be long. Let's go. So I have two nicely sized bags of pieces that I want to show you all. Um, I think what I'm gonna do is a try on haul that way you all can see what it is that some of these, how some of these pieces look. As far as, um, I guess, the lacy pieces and or undergarments, I may or may not show them. We'll see. But I mean, if I'm going to wear a swimsuit, I don't think anything's wrong with me showing certain pieces if it's not exposing too much um, and without me having to rate this channel 18 and older. So yeah, let's just get into the first bag. So the first few pieces that I have are, of course, like you know from Victoria's Secret, but it is their knockout line. For those of you that don't know, the knockout line is essentially one of the oldest lines that I've personally tried at Victoria's Secret. It's been around for a while, but they have an extreme compression fit. So if you are a girl that's looking for something to suck you in and make everything just nice, tight, and right, this is the line for you. This is the first pair that I want you all to see. I really, really like this pair because it does have a nice garter style. It is mid-rise, so um, it's not as high on the waist as I would like it. But other than that, I definitely love the fit. It does squeeze in the cheeks. So if that's a no-no for you, I don't suggest these pants for you. Other than that, I absolutely love these. The next pair is also a knockout. Um, It's just in this Bordeaux cranberry color. And I really, really like this. I love the fact that it, this pair of um pants come with an elongated pocket for those of you that do go running and want to place your phones and or other items in your pockets it's absolutely close and tight to the body the mesh on all of these items is very stretchable it doesn't tear or rip whenever i do put it in the wash again this pair and the last pair are mid-rise and they fit very very tight on the body and the butt area but nonetheless i love the fit of these as well now the newest workout pant that's available at victoria's secret is the total knockout what i like about these opposed to the other knockouts is the fact that they're a lot more lightweight and stretchy they still have that compression fit just not as much as the regular knockout um, so they definitely stretch with the body. They also come with the deep pockets as well off to the lateral side of the body. And what I do want to note is the fact that they have a very flat seam compared to the regular knockout. These seams almost feel as though they were made the same way as the regular material. It's hard to explain, but the seams are essentially not detectable. So I picked this pair up in a few more colors because I like it. So I'm gonna show you all what those colors look like now. So here it is in navy. I really, really, really like the navy ones. 
All right, and here is the light gray color. Oop, scratching my back up. Now the last one I have is in this polka dotted print. Um, I believe, to be honest, if I'm not mistaken, this polka dot print may be a little cheaper than those, which is weird. I believe there's a $5 difference, but it's basically within a $5 range of the other prints. Um, and also, I do want to note that in whatever size you wear in Victoria's Secret workout pants, typically, you want to go up a size in the total knockout. So they, like, if you put them next to your regular size, you'll figure it out. But typically I wear a small in the regular knockouts. And then these, I had to go up to a medium. And I just, like, I, trust me, that's just what you're going to want to do. Now for sports bras, I love the regular knockout sports bra. However, the player sport is something that I feel I could wear with a lot of random things. The knockout does have a compression feel and it does hold the girls in place. It's more of a maximum support type of bra. And this is a medium to light, light to medium support bra. Um, so if you're very heavy chested, you might want to steer clear of this. However, um, I love this sports bra a lot and it does I wear it in a size medium um it does come with a thicker band around it it is that racer back that has the racer back design um like I said or did I say this is one of the older prints however I just I have so many of these and I love the fact that they go with everything I just repurchase them and I'll show you all what the other colors I picked up look like all right, so I also purchased this in black. All right, guys, sorry about the sun, but this is what the new print and design of the player looks like. And here's what the back of it looks like. All right, so lastly, I picked it up in this light gray color. And here's the back. Now, for the days that I want to be casual yet sexy, um, I picked out this sleep top. It's like a collared button-down sleep shirt. I absolutely love this. Not only is it comfortable, I love the fit of it. I love how and where it hits me on my body. I love that you could show, you know, just a nice amount of cleavage where you could button it all the way up. Um, but essentially, it is absolutely very comfortable. The sleeves go down pretty far on it. Um, it's a little bit oversized, just a tad bit. I picked this one up in a size small. Um, however, I might want to get a, a medium just because of how it hits my butt area no that that actually looks fine but um yeah i love this i know you're gonna love it if you're that type of girl that likes to watch movies late at night this is definitely a movie wearing top now with regard to the bottoms i've always loved the way that victoria's secrets sleeping separates and or pants fit on me um, I love these in particular because of the wording at the bottom. It says love and angel in uh, silver. But the way that this hits my body accentuates everything. Um, typically, I wear a regular in their sizes, seeing as I'm 5'2". I'm pretty sure this is meant for someone way taller than me. But nonetheless, I'm still going to wear them. I love that they have pockets and they also come with a nice drawstring on them and I picked them up in another some other colors so I'll just show you the other colors and then the other material that I have is satin so I'll show you all those as well here they are in black and pink in the satin material and these cost just a little more than the regulars 
And here they are in navy with the pockets. Now for tops, I picked up this long sleeve Henley tee with a scoop neck and buttons. Um, just something that I could pair with any of my bottoms and or sleeping shorts. I love the way that this fits. I purchased this in a size small. I probably could have gotten an extra small, but I'm pretty comfortable with where and how this small fits. And lastly, from Pink, because I believe this item, I think it was on sale, if I'm not mistaken. Um, I purchased this off-the-shoulder crop tee. I plan on wearing it with some sweatpants and a pair of my um, Hirachis. But I love how lightweight this is. I love how long the sleeves are and the fact that I still have room to tie her up in the front so for those of you that don't like to see bras panties or anything of that sort including lace you might want to click out of this video i appreciate you watching um and yeah so i'm gonna give you all about six seconds to click out and we're gonna jump into the next section of this video with bras pennies and everything lace all right, so the first piece that I picked up that I absolutely love because it is versatile as not only a top or a bra, but as a sleeper because as you see, it matches my, um, my pants perfectly. So what this is, is a, essentially a bra, like I said, or a top that I love. I love the fact that it is off the shoulder, but it can be worn on the shoulder with a pair of jeans or a blazer or whatever it is that you want to wear it with. But also the fact that this comes with sticky adhesive in the inside to keep her sitting up whenever you do want to wear her off the shoulder, as well as boning around the waist to keep it up. The only thing I don't like about it is the fact that if the wind blows, you see these white pads or cream colored pads underneath. So I wish it was made like the pattern was made throughout the body of the bra. Nonetheless, I absolutely love this piece. Next, I have two Dream Angel push-up sets um, without the padding. Both of them are exactly the same. So I picked up one in uh, this light sky blue color. Again, it doesn't have any padding. It's very lacy. I would show this, but you will see all of my business and I'm not gonna have that. So what I love about this is the fact that the lace comes above the trim of the bra, which makes it just that much more sexy. And I picked up this, I believe this is a thong, like a chikini type thong. It said it's a wide, wide side thong, but I picked that up to go with it. And again, I bought the same thing in black and the same underwear in black as well. But I also wanted to pick these undergarments up to go with it. Um, and they do go with them. Victoria's Secret is notorious for having different undergarment types to go with their bras. So I wanted to pick up this style also. Additionally, I wanted a long line style of bra. And I picked up this one because this would go beautifully under my sheer tops because it's very sexy and lacy but also because it does show the boning around the diaphragm area, which I absolutely love. And with that, I picked up quite a few pair of the Dream Angels panties to go along with it. So I picked up some cheeky styled ones. I can't, what is the exact name of it? It is the Body by Victoria Styles to go with it. And then also I picked up 
these other thongs. And typically I'm not a thong person because they're pretty thick. Um, but I picked these up because they're very, very lightweight. Hopefully I don't have any issues with filling those. But the fav my favorite type of thongs to pick up from Victoria's Secret, if I do decide that, um, like if I had to pick a thong that I like, it's the ones that are extremely thin. I don't know if you all could see that, but these are next to nothing thin. So yeah, these are definitely my favorite types. Now another set that I picked up again that I would show if it weren't so sheer is another Dream Angels bra. I believe that's what it is. It is, it's a push up without padding bra. That is what she looks like. And I picked up the matching undergarments to go with it, two different types. The first one is this one. That's what it looks like. There's the back of her. And then I picked up this other one which does tend to cover a lot more but it is sheer in the back and this is the chikini this other set is one that i've been wanting for a long time however i couldn't get my like when i first ordered it i found that the bra size didn't fit me which is weird for victoria's secret because i got my 34d or 32 double d period point blank but it is this long lined bra that is what she looks like it's supposed to come with straps i couldn't find the straps i don't know why maybe it's because it was on sale i was able to snag this baby up for 30 dollars, which is a lot cheaper than what it was that i originally paid for it before i returned it um and i had to purchase this one in a 32C and it actually fits the same cup sizes as my 34Ds so I don't know what's up with that but nonetheless I absolutely love this and I picked up a pair of un the matching undergarments to go with it it's high-waisted and uh, yeah these aren't thongs they're the mid-rise cheeky panty and I picked these up in a medium all right so this is what this one looks like it is super super sexy the only thing i don't like is that see i would expose everything but i'm not which but i'm kind of exposing things anyway it's the fact that i wish these like i might get it taken in a little bit because it's making me look more square than i'm comfortable with however the top looks like this she is beyond beautiful and i love the way she sits up like i could wear this alone to be honest with a nice blazer or um like a sheer top or something because i love how it sits on my body all right so the last piece i have is this t-shirt bra and this is what it looks like. Again, I'm only showing it because if this were a swimsuit, I would show everything. Um, and the matching panty, which has like this Victoria's Secret logo on it. I love how comfortable these are. It does tend to have like a slight push-up feel. And it's, I wouldn't say it's padded. It's more of a full coverage type of bra or... Um, I don't know like it, it has like a small amount of padding in it it's not padded if that makes sense it's just it's covered enough to hide the you know that area right there that protrudes out so yeah that's what this one looks like and I could definitely wear this bra every day lastly from this section I picked up just some everyday underwear which I feel like all of them are the same, so I'm only going to show one. Are extremely comfortable yet sexy. They are the string bikini penny. And I don't know if they're discontinuing this line, but I like them because they're sexy. 
because of that string. Like, they're regular underwear, but they're sexy because of that string. And, yeah, I, I love this for lounging around the house and, like, a t-shirt or something. Um, yeah, this is definitely one of my favorite underwear just in general from Victoria's Secret. All right, so these underwear are supposed to go with the top that I'm about to show you. However, because these are sheer, I'm not going to be showing that much, even though I'm going to be showing a lot. Um, but these are the Cheeky Panties by Victoria's Secret. I'm trying to see the line. Well, it just says Cheeky, but that's what they look like. And the outfit that they go with is this one. Um, this is what she looks like. I've seen people wear it out, um, stuff like this out, but that's what it looks like. This is what the back looks like. It's definitely adjustable at the strap area, but yeah, I absolutely love, uh, this piece. Sorry that the light is going in and out. It's like extremely sunny today, but I absolutely love this piece on. Um, I'm probably going to use it as a cover up for my swimming suits. I don't know. We will see. We will, like if you see me post it, then you know, but yeah, I love how this looks. All right. So my last piece is this bodysuit is not buttoned right now. If it were, this would be a lot flatter. Um, I'm probably going to go up a size, and it's not because it was like difficult to get into, but because I want more length in the area that um, buttons. So this is what it looks like. What I love the most about it is the fact that it has like this button spine going down the back of it, which looks so, so, so cute. And I'm probably just going to wear it out like this, to be honest, with um, just a regular black bra underneath it because I think that it is so cute, like a bra that doesn't have white straps nonetheless. But um, yeah, I love this. All right, guys, that just about does it for this video. Hopefully you all liked everything that I showed you. If you did, I will list the items down in my bottom bar. That way you all can click the link and be directed toward Victoria's Secret site. Nonetheless, if you did like the video, please give me a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and share this video. And if you want more videos like this, please hit that notification bell, which is somewhere near the subscribe button, I believe. Um, and yeah, I think that's just about it for this video and uh, me. And uh, yeah, until next time, guys, I will talk to you all in my next video. Peace.